Plans are underway to rebuild a bridge in Stroudsburg that's been closed for nearly four years. 2822 Sydney Costas has more on concerns from at least one resident who wants answers for when that span will finally open to traffic. It's been like this for a long time, too long. Joan Fitzgerald points at the yard of her Stroudsburg home that's been turned into a construction site as prolonged repairs continue on the Glenbrook Road Bridge. This section of her property along McMichael Creek was cleared of privacy trees two years ago so crews could bring in heavy machinery. I want answers at this point. Answers she says she's been asking for after officials told her the project would be completed last year. The bridge has been closed since sustaining damage in August 2020 by Tropical Storm Isa Ias. Road closure signs have been in place since. The detour for drivers to get from that side of the bridge to this side here on Glenbrook Road takes around 16 minutes. Fitzgerald says time is her number one frustration, but not those extra minutes in the car. It's been a long time. It's a dirty project. It's a loud project when they're here. And, you know, we, we live here. We picked this spot on purpose so that it could be a nice place to live. And it, we just have to look at all this. These concerns have been brought to the attention of local leaders like Senator Rosemary Brown. What most people get frustrated with is, hey, we know we have to do work. We want the work done. But when is it long enough, long enough? And uh, this project definitely has taken too long. Uh, but there have been some obstacles throughout the process. PennDOT officials say creating a bridge plan quickly is no easy feat as they can take up to 10 years to safely build. Those officials tell me construction crews haven't been at the site due to the contractor actively designing the bridge and coffer dam, an enclosure that diverts water away during repairs. Portions of it were being designed as other portions were already designed and moving forward and being constructed. And there were some restrictions on when uh, work could be done in, in the stream. Uh, due to environmental concerns. Young says construction crews will be back at the site within the next two to three weeks, and they aim to have the new bridge completed by the end of this year. In Stroudsburg, Sydney Costas, 2822 News. And those PennDOT officials tell 2822 News when it comes to a bridge replacement, there are there is a lot of work involved since the spans are built to last up to 100 years. And